case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The Supreme Court of the United States addressed the issue of whether unions can make non-members pay for political activities without their permission in the 2012 case Knox v. Service Employees International Union, Local 1000. The case involved the SEIU, a public sector union, proposing a temporary increase in employee fees to build a political fightback fund. This proposal required non-members to opt out rather than opt in and pay a percentage of the special assessment, even if they opted out. The district court agreed with the petitioners, but the Ninth Circuit panel reversed the decision. The case then went to the Supreme Court, which granted certiorari while the ongoing dispute over the adequacy of SEIU's refund notice continued. Ultimately, the Supreme Court ruled that the First Amendment does not permit a public sector union to require non-members to fund its political and ideological projects. However, they allowed the union to calculate the fee non-members must pay based on its expenses from the previous year for administrative convenience. The court further held that public sector unions could not collect fees or assessments from non-members without their explicit consent, as it violated their First Amendment rights. They also required a new Hudson notice when unions imposed special assessments or due increases. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class